Hi everybody! The holiday season is here, and we've put together a special video to help us celebrate the season. Keep watching to hear from the singers in the choir, and hear about the holiday traditions we have that help us to mark the season. Happy holidays from all of us at Exaltate Chamber Singers. Hi! I always get a big charge out of decorating our mantelpiece at this time of year. I hope that your traditions stay strong and that you have as good a holiday as you possibly can. Aside from putting up the Christmas tree, my favorite holiday tradition is baking cookies with my mom and my sister. We've already baked about five different cookies so far, and besides baking them, my favorite part is eating them. Happy holidays, everybody. Growing up, I actually didn't have a lot of Christmas traditions in my family, but um, this year, I think we're gonna start some of our own. And the first one's gonna be uh, getting family matching Christmas hats and wearing them on Christmas morning. Merry Christmas, everyone. One of our favorite ornaments on our Christmas tree is this quirky little wooden house that was handmade by a wood carver in Prince Edward Island and given to us by our good friend Carrie. And it's one of the first ornaments we put on the tree every year. One of my long-standing Christmas traditions is to watch the Queen's message on Christmas Day. At home, we used to gather around the telly with eggnog and a mince pie or two. These days I watch it on YouTube, but the eggnog is definitely still a thing. My extended family includes many musicians, amateur and professional, We've gathered for over 40 years every Christmas to sing carols in four-part harmony, complete with descants. I'll miss my family this year, but we'll still sing carols with my husband and two young sons to carry on this special family tradition. One of our Christmas Eve traditions is listening to a CBC story, a 30-minute story, read by Alan Maitland called The Shepherd. It is a story set on Christmas Eve 1957 about a disabled jet trying to return to England. It is guided in by a rescue plane called a shepherd. Hello, Exultati friends. Wishing you a very Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. We miss you and look forward to singing for you again in 2021. In my family, my mom makes upwards of 100 latkes and my cousins, aunts and uncles and I all share them and spread out around the house for a big Hanukkah party. And then on Christmas Day, we go skating. At holiday time, I love having a few amaryllis blossoms in the house. Fun fact, the amaryllis flower stands as a symbol for determination, strength and hope. In the last few years, I've made it a tradition to visit this really magical street in Toronto called Cringlewood, and I thought I'll take you with me. Happy holiday, everyone. 